Hello, this is Troy Stavros, broker and partner with The Holloway Group at Gables & Gates Realtors, here to talk to you about what the future holds for the national housing market. Whether we're working with buyers, talking with our sellers, talking with past clients, talking with acquaintances, or talking with complete strangers, the question is always, what's going on with real estate? And where is it gonna to be tomorrow? Well, we have some information that we've received from the latest predictions from the National Association of Realtors, and we're here to share them with you. The following predictions were given by Lawrence Yoon, Chief Economist for the National Association of Realtors, and they were given at the recent 2012 Realtors Conference and Expo in Orlando. And with these predictions, he gave the caveat that there will be no additional tightening in lending and that we were, are able to avoid a fiscal cliff. And without those two caveats, these predictions are likely to be valid. The first prediction deals with home prices. The prediction showed a 6% increase in 2012 in home prices, followed by a 5.1% increase in home prices in 2013, and then similar increases for 2014. Along with prices, sales are expected to increase each subsequent year as well with a 9% increase in 2012 to 4.64 million sales, in 2013 increasing to 5.05 million sales, and then 2014 increasing to 5.3 million sales. Distressed sales, which currently hover around 25% of all sales nationally, are expected to decrease to about 8% in 2014. Mortgage interest rates are expected to increase to an average of around 4% for 2013 and then move upward to about 4.6% in 2014 because of inflationary pressures. Looking at the local Knoxville market and looking at distinct indicators such as low inventory, buyer demand, and competitive bidding on many properties, this tells me that there's only one place for this market to go, and that is up. We have to remember that our market is different than the national market and that we weren't affected as much by the housing bubble. We did not fall as much, so there wasn't that far for us to come back up. But those indicators tell us that prices will increase because when there's a lack of supply, then demand makes prices go up. Now, the only reason that this would not happen is if for some reason, local buyers can't get the money to buy. So that goes back to the two caveats that were expressed by Lawrence Yoon. One, if there's tighter lending standards and buyers can't get money, then it could have an effect on the predictions. And two, if for some reason we cannot avoid a fiscal cliff, that could have major implications as well. If you have any questions at all about Knoxville real estate or real estate in general, feel free to give us a call at 865-236-1333 or visit us at www.hometeamknoxville.com. This is Troy Stavros with The Holloway Group, and I'll talk to you again soon.